finale of Carrie Diaries. Carrie is getting ready to go to prom, as is Mouse and Maggie. Carrie doesn't have a prom date because her and Sebastian broke up in the episode before. And while Carrie is mourning that loss of relationship, Dorit is, uh, she's found new love. So we'll see that, what that turns into. Walt is struggling with his sexuality and we'll see how that turns out. I'm really happy um, as an actress that we can push boundaries in TV and um, I think especially with Walt's character, I think it is relatable for a lot of young people. A lot of people on Twitter and, and, and people will walk up to me on the street and they're like, I love Walt, I'm going through that or I went through that and it's really special to be able to hear that and know that we're portraying his character honestly in a lot of the situations honestly. Um, I think high school relationships are riddled with drama and confusion of kind of what you want and um, what you want your future to look like, but you're sort of stuck in this present, in this bubble. I'm happy that we can show those sort of struggles and also make fun of them. I had a great high school experience, and I feel lucky that I'm able to portray real relationships with people instead of just those bratty sort of stabbing people in the back relationships that I feel like a lot of the other TV shows sort of display. All the actors, we all have tight friendships, so that comes across on screen. I feel so blessed to have the cast that we do. They're awesome. We all have such a great time together and so much fun just goofing around. We go on Instagram and look at little animals <laughs> and food. Most of the time we take you know little breaks to craft services and eat chocolate mostly. <laughs> I'll miss someone picking out my clothing. <laughs> all the bright fun colors and skirts and Every episode there's always usually some sort of event so I get to wear some fun dress. Episode 12, there was this sparkly strapless piece. Very pretty, hard to keep up. Chafed arms, you know, that whole business. I'm happy that we're living in the time now but it is fun to play 80s and with the big hair and the style. I mean, I feel like people back then were just so much, um, more wacky. If a man walked down the street in a powdered blue suit and bright yellow shoes, I think people people would think he's cool. Nowadays, he'd be like, what's he on? <laughs> so it's been a lot of fun, and my hair, I've always wanted to have curly hair, so it's a lot of fun to play around with. Next season, I hope we shoot in the city a bit more. I, I really like being able to shoot at historical places, and, and then when I'm just on my own personal time walking down the street, being like, oh, I filmed there. Oh, I, I've been in there. To carry right now. I tell her to calm down, not stress out so much, that everything will be okay, and to enjoy her time in New York, and things will fall into place. <laughs>